So we talk about that I will discuss it's all about ridges of curvature. So in different geometry, the ridges of curvature are is the reciprocal for of a curvature. For a curve, it equals the radius of the circular arc which best approximates the curve at the point. For surface, the radius of curvature is the radius of a circle that best fits a normal section or combination theory. So in, uh, in this graph, is our curve, then our radius of curvature, and then center of curvature, which is imaginary, and then uh, imaginary circle completing the curve. So let's have an example. Um, for a semicircle, our radius A uh, in the upper half plane with R is equal to absolute value of negative a is equal to a then y is equal to square root of a squared minus x squared uh, first derivative of y is equal to negative x all over a squared minus x squared then second derivative is equal to um, negative a squared all over a squared minus x squared raised to 3 half so for a semicircle of a radius a in a lower half plane y is equal to negative um, a squared minus x squared so the, rest, uh, the circle of a radius is has a radius of curvature equal to a So in ellipse, uh, major axis 2A and minor axis 2B. The vertices on the major axis have the smallest radius of the curvature in a point R is equal to B squared all over A. And then the vertices on the minor axis have the largest radius of curvature at, po at any point R is equal to A squared all over B. So the radius of curvature of ellipse of a function of a parameter t is r times t is equal to b squared cos squared t plus a squared sin squared t all over 3 half uh, sorry raised to 3 half all over a b then where theta is, is equal to inverse of tan y over x is equal to inverse of tan times b over a tan t so the radius of curvature of an ellipse as a function of theta is equal is r theta is equal to um, a squared all over b times 1 minus a squared times 2 minus e squared times cos theta squared all over 1 minus e squared cos theta squared raised to 3 half. So where the, uh, where the ensign Electricity of the ellipse E is given by E squared is equal to 1 minus B squared over A squared. So that's all for today's video. Thank you.